What's up everybody? This is the Awesome Nerd Show. Um, back again playing on Ark Survival Evolved. Um, now first off, if you see things look a little different, that is because I am on uh, the very first server, so I'm on the original island. So here's the map so you can see uh, kind of, you know, that I am on the old map or whatever um, playing today. And so I'm on this one because there is that new um, update that uh, was dropped with the um, Redwood Forest and Titanosaurus and everything. Um, well, I have started to do a base build um, in the Redwood Forest because um, I was just kind of trying it out and everything and I thought it was super cool. Um, so I decided uh, um, I'd probably do a video or two and once they update it more because it's not fully out yet. Um, but once they do more to it, I will, of course, do more episodes um, building at it or on it and everything. Um, so I'm just going to start off by flying on my Quetzal here over to um, the Redwood Forest. Hopefully there's no gigas along here, as there usually are. It's a cool red RG. Um, so it'll take a little while to fly over, but hopefully... Um, this won't take too long. Now I've already, as I said, I've um, started to build um, on it already. Um, first off, I know it's not very close, but as you can see, there's the new uh, snow um, mountain, or s mountain covered with snow, I should say. Um, that was a part of the update as well. I've not been over there yet, but I did see in that little bay up, um, kind of like where the top of the Quetzal's hair is, there that I'm moving across, um, there is a... Uh, Kind of like some, uh, uh, water, uh, gl I want to say glaciers, but that may be what they are. The thing, uh, I can't remember it off the top of my head right now. But anyway, there's stuff out in the water and everything, so, um, I just saw those in the distance. Um, so there may be some penguins on those now on this map. Um, but I did build right, just right here, like towards the edge of the forest. Um, the redwood forest so um, just a little bit in from this green drop but I'll show you uh, some stuff kind of why I chose um, this area um, now I have been really surprised with this redwood forest one of how awesome it looks like just seeing this um, I love so much because I am a huge uh, of course Star Wars fan and especially uh, Return of the Jedi is my favorite one with all the Ewoks and everything so just seeing this just reminds me of Endor so much and so I, when I saw I had to move here, but I um, used this site over here to get uh, materials and stuff because that is one thing I found out from the Redwood Force. Um, but there is this little log you can walk through to get between it, so I thought it was really cool. Um, but so here's my platform that I've started to build on and my little shelter here. Whoa. Um, if I can land or not. I have a really hard time landing the Quetzal on top of the house, but I have it land up there because I guess I could maybe have it land up on the platform. There are a lot of dangerous things on the ground here. It's, I don't know if this stuff's supposed to be in here um, that I've seen, uh, but I've seen snakes, sarcos, so I don't know if that's just a remnant of the... Um, or with the swamp being so close but of course there's um parasers uh the bronos gallimimus there's a lot of alpha raptors and t-rexes um just all sorts of dangerous things that live um in here of course there's a bunch of meganura and everything flying around but i haven't had much problems with it yet but yeah there's pretty much everything there's i've even seen a lot of the uh um can't remember what their name in Ark is, but they're the, uh, like, reindeer or whatever. Um, I've seen a lot of those in here, too. There goes a bunch of terror birds running off in the distance. But, yeah, just the beauty of the Redwood Forest here um, is amazing. Um, but we'll get to work, I guess. Um, now, my biggest problem, which I mentioned that um, I was having some problems, is that uh, a lot of the trees you can't knocked down or anything for wood which is what um one of the biggest questions which i have to point this out real quick the stuff under the um platform here it's got all this like stuff hanging from it but none of it does anything so 
it'll be interesting to see if they update any of that um, coming up but you can't really knock any of these trees down which um, that's what I was saying we were wondering about because if you build a platform couldn't someone just knock like cut the tree down and knock your base over but like this you can't do anything to so to um, get stuff you have to find uh, things like this tree right here this tree the real small ones um, are what you can use to tear stuff down and then um, there's not a lot of those around so it's kind of hard to get um, everything you need so I got resources here which I believe actually that um, the Quetzal has stuff that I stored on it from yesterday so this is the new rope ladder too if you have not seen it um, I don't know if there's a let me see if we can so there now it's all rolled up again and then you can just um, extend it back down and it's all the way back down to the ground um, and now the ladder you do have to build like normal ladders so you have to build it piece by piece and then place it together all the way um, down um, so that's kind of I mean I guess it makes sense but it's kind of weird at the same time because it's rope ladder not actual ladder so you, you don't usually build in uh, sections or whatever but anyway so we'll go ahead and take go and take some of that even though it can easily get fiber and we'll just take a bunch of this thatch off here since we'll need thatch I don't know how much I can carry it's got some meat. put the meat back on okay But yeah, so my goal for this was to uh, build this platform and try and get it um, built on like I've started doing and then possibly like go to this tree or something and build or a nearby tree over there or that one. But you, right now there's no way you can connect um, the platforms without uh, building um, like a bridge with ceilings and uh, pillars and everything. Um, so it's kind of... Um, took the fun out because I could, thought you could do like rope bridges or some kind of like step type thing um, but apparently you can't so we'll take a bunch of this and right now we need a lot of foundations because um, you can't build on the platform which I think is kind of stupid but um, I don't know if they'll try and fix that or what because I think you should be able just to build right on the platform but apparently they don't want that for some reason so you have to put the foundations down and then build out but anything that you can set on the ground you can go ahead and put on the platform so I guess that uh, it's like any storage chest and uh, pretty much anything that you try and place and it doesn't say it needs a foundation or something you can go ahead and place it now I've lost the foundation. There it is. Yeah, I'll just craft a bunch up here. And then we'll go up and try and place them down and try and make them look as nice as we possibly can. Um, it's hard because the platform's got, you know, the roundish shape to it. Um, and we don't have, like, foundations that can match that shape. So you have to really just mess with stuff. Um... But we'll just do it the best that we can. Let's see what else do I have. Looks like fiber is what's needed now. So we're going to just finish up using the... Like completely encumbered. Put on a lot of this. See if that helps now. There we go. Guess I won't build stuff, but we'll go ahead and climb back up. Mm -hmm. 
Um, so to place, uh, I guess I didn't do it. Well, yeah, I did. Um, now when I placed like this first foundation, because this was the first one I placed, I got it to line up um, directly uh, straight with this edge here, like as best as I could, um, which it did look like it was almost perfect. Um, but yeah, so I uh, got that one laid out and then it of course didn't fill the space all the way but then I'll probably try and place one here and go that way um, but we'll just fill in all the way as far as we can which I did see I think that um, the arc devs released a tutorial on how to build um, so I'm um, which I saw the video but I didn't actually watch it but I, um, I may look at it to see what they um her I don't know if they released it but someone released the thing that was how to build um but like I said I haven't seen it so I don't know uh, may have to do it over here there's some lag may have to start over here let's get rid of that go into K mode zoom out and so as you can see it's relatively uh kind of close there oh oops that's not what i wanted let's go back out of k mode turn just a little until it looks like we get it pretty even move out to the edge and then just come over as far as you can against the center thing you can swing all the way around to get a better view which looks like that's pretty decent maybe you can, um, turn it in to the right a little Let's see that now so that looks pretty good so we're going back up just to get it buried a little I think that's good enough. Ooh. Why does this seem like it's Let's try something here? Yeah, it did start to stick out, so it obviously wasn't um, perfect. It did look really close, but it's obviously not. Um, we'll go ahead and lay. So it looks like there you can overlap. I don't know how much it's. Say, is there stuff attacking my quetzal? Wow, this is wacky. Oh, this is so weird. Well, I guess it's besides up here. I don't know if you can. Oh, I'm out of foundations. I'll have to go build. I don't know if you can maybe get one to fit in there like all these did. Super weird. Um, but I think I'm gonna um, build some more things and try and get stuff placed down, and um, maybe if I can possibly get this um, all finished and. Uh, built all the way across and stuff I'll uh, bring it back and we'll see how it's how or what I could get done and everything so um, I'll work on that and then we'll be right back okay guys and we're back um, now I finished putting up all the foundations now I'll fly up here um, so you can see uh, 
maybe. Oh yeah, I'm in K mode. I was like, what am I doing? Um, and so, whoa, uh, this. Um, so as you can see, I got foundations placed all around, but as you can see, they're um, in crazy directions and everything. Um, can I move? Nope. Let's see, can I move now? There we go. Can move real slow. Um, so I started out. Uh, I kind of replaced some of the foundations, but I started. Um, each part on the like this um, section here as you can kind of see if I do the like right here and I just did it on this um, so on the right of this uh, I don't know what you call it, like beam I guess on every single section um, so I did that all the way across so I did um, pl place this one that went three across and just did that all the way around and then when I got back over here um, to this center row right here I then uh, just went to the next row down so like did all the first ones and moved this one and just kept following it around and just kept doing a loop all the way around the tree um, as much as I could but in doing so it left a lot of holes so I was able to then go through back and uh, through maneuvering and stuff uh, place foundations in like at these weird angles forming like the waffle look um, but there were a couple spots um, there was like this weird spot that I couldn't get one to place and then this spot there but I was able to like kind of maneuver some to place in spots and everything so most of it is filled and then like I can't get any more to place around the tree here um, so that's not uh, too bad it did fill so um, fill up most of the things so I should be able to pretty much place anything I want um, up here, but I did go ahead and make a bunch of uh, railings and stuff to place. Um, so obviously you can't really place one here. It could do like this, um, but I don't really feel that's necessary. I don't. I may try and find something to do to block that, but I'm not exactly sure if there's anything. Um, but I'm hoping maybe in like the next update or in a random update, the developers do. Um, for the game that they'll f maybe fix something with the platforms to make them more buildable because I think um, I don't know exactly what shape this is I know it's um, I call it I say it's round and stuff but obviously it's you know like a um, octagon or something along those lines I haven't stopped to measure or to count the exact sides on it but it's something you know like I said, along those lines. Um, but with Arc, everything's built in like squares, pretty much. And there's not um, the ability to do octagons. So you have to build with these weird um, shapes like this or build out over the platforms in a weird manner. But uh, let's go ahead and block this off like that. Um, and so I could build out like I did here where put another like row I could just you know continue this on and everything but I think this is plenty of space now the only problem is as I said earlier there are a lot of bugs um, that fly around out here so you um, unless you completely close it off I um, would say there's no way to uh, probably have a base here um, because the bugs just randomly fly, but yet while I've been up here and having the Quetzal up here and everything It's never been attacked by bugs. I don't know if they only stay to a certain um, Level unless they're you know provoked obviously um, I'm not like I said not sure about that whole thing but I think that's uh, Probably gonna be all the building like I said, I don't really play on this one like this is the um, map that I've been playing on uh, since um, I've started playing, which was, as I mentioned before, back in December. Let's see if I can do this. I know it's not going to work. Nope. Um, I was going to point out, but I uh, um, have built this, so I'll probably do like some work on this and try and uh, get some stuff put over here. 
to maybe have this base and then so as more updates come out and everything go ahead and shut the door here um, but as more updates come out and everything uh, come over here and build and put more stuff on the platform but I think that's gonna be this I may add some like torches and some seating and stuff but it's probably gonna be it for the platform as I said until they um, get some of the new updates up and going um, so the last thing um, maybe there's a spino that I would like to do for the episode is um, I was gonna kind of fly since I showed off the um, redwood forest and stuff fly over to um, possibly show off this new snow biome so I'm trying to figure out where it even so it's on the other side of this mountain um, I'd like to try and find a titanosaur just to show it off but I'm obviously not gonna do anything with that since it's kind of um, pointless since I'm on here all by myself and stuff but it would be really cool just to see have, but I have no clue where they even spawn at so I don't know um, how to I would get them in here or where I should look for it but Ooh, there's a bunch of gigas and so um, as you can see they're also right by the giga like right at the top of the Quetzal's hair there's one of the new ruins um, that one's just a pillar but they have added um, ruins throughout the game now so it looks like that's probably all you can see there's not been I haven't hardly seen any of them let's check these Quetzal's real quick where to go okay. come on Quetzal 72 25 8 so I'm obviously looking for a really high level one to tame to have as a power dino let's say I'll probably freeze to death over here and I have yet to make any fur in the game um, I've always tried to collect fur but um, every time I go over to like get the pelt and everything I just um, always die I'll go in and put my um, leather armor back on since it obviously has some more insulation to it. It's not really. Because um, in the redwood forest it's really hot, so I thought that uh, that is not what I wanted to do at all. Um, I thought it'd give me like more insulation and, or cool me down better. Um, but in doing so I realized I don't have a hat for the metal so I don't know where I lost my um, stuff for that but I'll just have to watch my health and everything flying over here um, so as I said this is there it used to be over there again by the above the Quetzal side used to be the only snow mountain and now they've um, switched this one to it as well um, so I have to kind of fly through and as I said hopefully I won't die or anything from the cold so yeah it looks just pretty much like they took the existing mountain and threw some snow on it didn't add too much there but they did as I uh, mentioned add this stuff over here there's an alpha raptor um yeah it looks like they cleared out added oh I thought those were penguins but it looks just like rocks or something what's over in here so it doesn't look like they really extended any of the snow stuff over this way I do see that I am taking damage from the cold so I'll have to leave soon um, but just like um, I don't really see any like any of the dinos that get pelled or anything which they may um, reappear soon or something with uh, resetting the servers and updates and stuff like that but yeah they added all this um, like glacier type thing or iceberg I guess which is the word I was looking for earlier but I don't see any penguins on it which would be just a bunch of rocks and everything so as I said I don't know if they're gonna add more stuff in later updates but yeah that had 
nothing on it so it's just like why'd you put it there if there's no benefit to it besides the look um but then over here is my second base that i started working on before um they released the center and stuff because i'd started working on this and then um i switched to the xbox and played with friends and everything and then uh just kind of gave up and then once they released the center map i switched back over um to playing uh arc again and stuff and so i've never uh finished this and stuff but i have an empty house i'll just go ahead and just show off here i so i just kind of placed foundations wherever um like i started one then i placed wherever i could to a certain length and of course for some reason i don't know with the new update stuff all the plants and rocks and everything grew back in the bases so like when i came over here this whole side of the house had a um like into the outside stuff was covered by a rock the old base where i started out in in the episode um it was had rocks everywhere and stuff but yeah this is just kind of um the base i have all these little um it's weird that I don't know if I just never noticed before, but it's like they put a little island type thing out there in the water, which would be a really good place to put a um, greenhouse, which is what I was planning on doing and stuff. But yeah, I was planning on getting rid of that other base and completely moving over here. But as I said, I just never got around to it. Here's another little um, porch type thing. Shut that door. And then, yeah, there's just that. So I'd have all down here for crafting and stuff and storage and just the upstairs for like decorating and everything. Then I have a um, octagon taming pin over here with some of the dinos I've been using over here to build. So I have my Carno little arms just to do decorous and then Dasher because I was going to get one because when I first got this it was around Christmas stuff so I was going to get um, eight reindeer and stuff. But yeah, then the Dodicarus, which by the way, not that many people know or care and stuff, but Dodicaruses are my favorite dino in the game. Like when playing on the Xbox, um, I got playing with them and stuff, and I just absolutely love them. I don't know why, but I do. Kite and helmet. Thought maybe I put my helmet in here. I do have a lot of building materials. Um... Which I did build a lot of railings to put on that uh, wooden platform um, the, in the forest, but uh, then I like split it in half and everything and uh, took what I could carry and then that's all that I needed. Um, and I still have seven left, so I have a bunch of railings now. Um, so I'm going to just fly back to my base, which is right back over here. I wonder if they added anything to the um, dead island up here. Any of the ruins or anything. As we get closer, we'll I figured they'd at least maybe put something uh, in the center. Oh, now it's gotten dark. Which, um, if the gamma may be too bright, it's because in that redwood forest, I have to turn the gamma up at least to, um, five to be able to see anything. Um, because it's just so dark in there. But yeah, it doesn't look like they added any ruins to that. Oh, and then I have my little, um, taming pin over here that I'll fly over. What are those just rocks? What is that? This must be some ruins. Huh. It's kind of weird just having... See, stuff like this is what I... doesn't make any sense. Let's see if we can destroy any of... Nope. Like, what's the point of just putting these little platform things down? There, I don't know if my, uh... Well, I would think I'd say that if my little pin here is obstructing something about just little platform things like that like what's the point of it <laughs> like if you're gonna you know put the effort in to put ruins and stuff in make them actually worth looking at not just two little stone blocks or whatever that was but i um haven't flown much of the island since the update 
like obviously went up to there because that's where I have my um, uh, whatever they're called of uh, like furnaces or whatever to convert metal and stuff because the platform requires metal which if you've not seen those platforms um, that's why I built that whole little base over there um, with the beaver in it because um, I thought the beaver, you know, since it works as a smithy that I could use it um, to build stuff in, but it, you have to have a smithy, so I built a, a little shelter over um, in the redwood forest um, to be able to put a smithy and keep the beaver there and everything. Um, but here's the cost of it, and as you can see, you have to have metal ingots, um, I assume, for the look of, like, the stuff that hangs under it, because there is some metal in that, but everything else there's not. Um, but... Uh, just show off the, how much that stuff costs and it's kind of high price and everything but yeah here's my kibble farm that I was gonna as I said move all the way over to that other base we just came from but probably I'm just done with that and I'll just use this map to play with like the redwood forest and some of the new updates and stuff um, but I guess that'll probably be it for today um, be sure to like subscribe and comment um, check out our other videos and um, gaming and boxing stuff that we did for um, the month of June and everything. And we'll see you next time.